can, so I'm gonna take off this coat because you know we're gonna get to some heavy duty pirate drinking. Oh, he's so, just a hot pirate. So, uh, the love of a pirate's life, Rob. Okay, so it's like there's nothing worse than a pirate drinking rum out of a plastic cup. That is a no-no. You will be cursed in eternal damnation if you drink out of a plastic cup. Alright? So, the proper vessel is a tanker. Not just any tanker, but the pirate king tanker. So, this tankard is a giant tankard with a leather cover and this uh, casted pewter skull and crossbow. So. Alright, this you can put 24 ounces of rum, ale, or grog. So, think about that. But if you're not such a heavyweight, you can do the normal, you see, giant, normal, 16 ounces versus 24. And this is made of uh, lead-free pewter because we don't really want you to get lead poisoning out of our cup. So this is, this is uh, the standard device for rum drinking for pirates. But if you wanted something a little more shiny and easy to put in your dishwasher, you would get this 18 ounce um, stainless steel tanker. Nice and shiny. Oh, and because sometimes you are uh, drinking and you might lay your tanker down get it you wouldn't want that so you would want to take one of these deluxe anchored straps and put it on your belt and then be able to unstab it and these are really good straps because even if you're sort of drunk you still can do like that all right so it comes, uh, the straps can come in black or brown, uh, silver or, or brass. All right, so those of you that want to display your horniness for the other uh, sex, you can advertise with the horny tanker. All right, so it too is um, 16 ounce pewter. And um, the strap, and we also have the regular straps. Okay, these come both in the same brown and black, silver and nickel um, period buckles. So this goes through your belt, and then this you unbuckle and you put through there. So these are a little harder, especially if you're drunk, to get on and off. They are very secure and they're a little bit more affordable. So, I'm back to the giant. If you are a big drinker, you need a big tanker. Uh, it's the same one that's used on this without all the decoration. If you're more humble in your uh, plunder, you can just go with this one. But if you wanted the very most unique vessel for rum, this would be it. All right. So this is the Black Beard Skull Chalice. All right. See, so it has writing. It says death. To spots were so that was the governor who had um, Blackbeard uh, 
uh, killed. So the rumor is, is that, you know, they took Blackbeard's skull and they mounted it on the chalice. And this is a very lovely um, base, which looks like a compass rose. And there used to be a secret society who would drink to Blackbeard and then infuse them with special powers. And it was, um, we do a very secret ceremony once in a great time using this chalice. It is super heavy. It's about 16 pounds. So you need two hands to drink with it. But, you know, or if you just want to build up your muscles by, uh, you know, doing curls with it, you may. <laughs> All right, so those are, are on to our next subject, which is bottles. And speaking of skulls, we have the skull bottle. See, this is a lovely glass bottle that fills this six ounces of your favorite uh, refreshments. Uh, it's got its own little buckle strap so you could strap it on your belt. And with all our bottles, we have a, a, a real cork with a retaining strap that we hand weave little decorations into it. It's a real unique. Uh, bottle. Okay, so this is a alcohol uh, Okay. This is the bottle ball trick. Alright, so it fits, you know, like any ball trick or bandolier across your uh, chest. And then here, this carries a standard wine bottle, 750 milliliters, and it includes a pour spout. So then you could pop one of these stainless steel shot glasses and pour a shot of whatever your favorite beverage is and hand out. So you have eight of these stainless steel cups that go along here. And it's got the adjustable buckle back here to adjust to the, the right height. And it comes in different colored bottles. And this is perfect if you're being a pirate bartender. Then the next bottle we have is a small Calypso potion bottle, right? Here we have it in brown, and here we have it in purple, in red, and in blue. They come with the buckles, some of them are brass, some of them are nickel. And they uh, carry six ounces of uh, fluid. So in a pinch, you could put a fuse in it and use it as a granada. It only, only works if you have 155 rum or better. The next bottle is the Pirate Heart Bottle comes in red or blue and you know this is very symbolic because you know the, the love of a pirate's heart is towards rum and you know you could carry one on each side and our last bottle here 
is our squash buckler bottle in clear or brown. And you know, it has this uh, sort of squash shape, which is why we call it the squash buckler. Uh, it's all hand uh, knotted and they're very nice pieces to be carrying about yourself. The bottles are fairly durable. They uh, are um, tempered so that, you know, like a car window is. They also, they won't easily break, but if you throw them from a two-story building or stomp on it uh, on concrete, they probably will break. But overall, just in normal use, they're gonna be fine. The next thing is uh, for those pirates who are shy of glass because they're clumsy and they don't want to break stuff, they have come up with the flats. So these flats are stainless steel so you can drop them and they're not going to break. These are six ounces and they come with four different sayings that captains reserve. The Jol, uh, Jack Rackham, the Surrender the Booty, and the Time Flies When You're Having Rock. Okay, so these, you know, back then, they, well, you could put it in a pocket if you had a big pocket. What works better is if you put them in a flask holder and connected it to your belt. So they come in both brown and black. And if you have a treasure belt, you can get one with the clip to put on your belt. If you want more, you can get the Triple Trouble Glass Holder. And that's so you can carry your light rum, dark rum, and spice rum. These are designed, these have straps here that you slide your belt through so you can carry it on your um, waist. Now, if you got two of them, you would have a pirate six pack. And the next thing we have is the pirate uh, class belt. So this has uh, the medium sized 18 ounce class along with this four stainless steel shot glasses. Yeah, so this is a nice, comfortable, easy belt to uh, wear. And if you want, you could probably run it across your shoulders. And you know, this is more for the medium, the lightweight drinker, right? Somebody who doesn't quite need as many friends as our next one, right? And then, if you have a treasure belt, you can clip these on the D-rings and have that medium size 18 ounce glass. But if you wanted to make friends, we call this the friend maker or the, the pirate glass bulger. Now this is a huge glass. It is actually 64 ounces or a half a gallon. So now you can pour and pour and pour. pour. If you don't have friends, you will make lots of friends. You will be the life of the party if this is what you come garbed in. So some pirates like to fight and others like to party. So if you're the 
the party pirate, this is the thing for you. All right, so that is our lineup of different things that you can hold rum in or any refreshment. I mean, if you're a teetotaler, you could just put gunpowder tea in here, you know? Just don't try to light it on fire. 